No, don't touch me, sweetie. It's disgusting. I didn't see this before. It must have really changed. <laughs> the path must have been really different. Yeah. Yeah, I think I went the other way last time, and uh, he wanted to get to bed, uh, get in a bed with her, and I was like, no, fuck off. I'm disgusting. Aww. Luke sits down next to me on the toilet floor to hold my hair, even though it's a cock more fish. He whips a vial in the corner of my mouth and Do just I need to stares. fire someone? I don't feel sick. <laughs> that I think is based on if you show Rose the letter or not. Ah! Ah, probably, yeah. Just feeling a bit under the weather, dear. It's been unbearably hot as of late, hasn't it? I do wish it would rain. Are you sure it wasn't those sweets? <laughs> I told you not to eat those sweets. <laughs> Maybe. Well, don't laugh. Well, <laughs> I can't help if you make that sort of face. <laughs> <laughs> Starts chuckling, and soon enough, he's in a fit of laughter. This is actually quite sweet, cause like I said last time, if you do, he ends up even creepier, flirtier, and pisses Hannah off as he as she makes him sleep in the guest room. If not, well, he doesn't get all creepy and flirty as Isabella, and thus close enough to hear slash wake up. Oh, right. Ah, that makes sense, because this, this, him like this, I can, I can, I can see him as a kind of good guy like this, you know. Him there helping his wife and everything, and even having a little, uh, a little joke with her and that. Whereas the other route I took, he was an asshole, flirting with just about any skirt you see, and then, uh, and then uh, as Hannah, I basically told him to fuck off and sleep in the spare bedroom. <laughs> but no, I quite like this. This is quite sweet. This scene happening next to, to Lou, filled with sick, just makes the whole thing bizarre. And it nearly makes me start giggling as well. I try to stifle it though as I smack him on my I'm shoulder. I'm not making a face, Luke. Stop laughing. Shut up. <laughs> when you would not stop laughing, I would let myself go and laugh at bubbles for my own phone throat. And I forgot whatever ill feel. <coughs> whatever ill feelings plague, plague me. Oh, he's still a sleaze, but this way you get to see his few good points. But they are still few. He's the douche. Yeah, I get that sense. <laughs> we are just husband and wife, laughing together at a funny face. The little things in life. I let myself go because I know that these moments will not last forever. But if I just know the horrible thing... If I just know the horrible things that are to come for us, I would have wished with everything... I have then and there that the laughter stayed. <laughs>